The story of Peppa Pig. The story of Peppa Pig. My family tree. Oh. By Peppa Pig. Once upon a time, there was a lovable, slightly bossy little piggy named Peppa. Grunt. Squish, squish. More than anything in the whole world wide world, Peppa loved jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Mummy Pig was Peppa's mommy. She was very wise about most things. Mummy Pig would say, Peppa, when you jump in muddy puddles, you must wear your boots. Daddy Pig was Peppa's dad. He loved eating cookies. He had a big round tummy. When Daddy Pig jumped into muddy puddles, he made a very big muddy squash. When Peppa's little brother, George, was born, Peppa helped look after him. And soon George was old enough, Peppa taught him how to jump into put muddy puddles. George, Peppa said, just like Mummy Pig, if you jump in the muddy puddles, you must wear your boots. George liked muddy puddles, but it looked like his toy, Mr. Donaldson, more. Even more, George couldn't speak it yet. He could one day wear a dinosaur, grr. Sometimes Peppa got a little bit annoyed with George. George says with a sigh, why do you always say dinosaur for everything? It's so boring. One day, George and Mommy Pig, Daddy Pig, got into a little car and drove to the new house on top of the little green hill. Peppa was excited about the new house, but she was very excited about how wet and extremely muddy puddles in the yard. Beep, beep. Can we go and jump in the muddy puddles? asked Peppa. It's not time for bed, Peppa. You have to wait until tomorrow. Peppa and George wake up every next morning. Morning went to find Mummy the Daddy Pig. Hee hee hee. Can we please go outside and jump in the muddy puddles? asked Peppa excitedly. Snort, snort, yawn. We're going to Granny Grandpa Pig's house today, Peppa, replied Mummy Pig sleepy. You can jump in the muddy puddles there. At perfect. It's time to leave. So Peppa and her family jump in the little car. Ready? asked Daddy Pig cheerily. Yes, Daddy Pig, everyone answered back. Then let's go out, shouted Daddy Pig. Yippee, cried Pepe. She couldn't wait to get to Granny's Bambi Big House and jump in the muddy puddles. The time was soon arrived at Granny and Grandpa's house. Grandpa George was very excited. They loved going to visit George, Granny, and Grand Pig. Granny Pig, Granda Pig, cried Pepe. Grandy La, Manny La G, shouted George. Hello, my little ones, answered Granny Pig. Come inside, Granny, said, said Peppa. Can I jump in by metal puddles, please? I think Grandpa Pig is something to show you first, Peppa, said Granny Pig. Pig was a little disappointed. She really wanted to jump in the muddy puddles. Grandpa Pig took Peppa and George to the vegetable garden. This was the first time they grew vegetables. First, I plant some seeds, and then we eat our yummy vegetables, Grandpa Pig. Forgetting all about the muddy puddles, we have to wait for them to grow big bigger, replied Grandpa. Oh, grasped Pepe excited. Snort, snort. Suddenly, there was a loud bang. Oh, dear, grasped Grandpa Pig. There was a thunder. It means it's about to rain. We should hurry inside before we get wet. Pepe, George, Grandpa ran inside as fast as they could to get outside of the rain. Peppa and George watched the rain, splash, splash, splash. Down the window, George started to cry. Don't cry, George, said Peppa. It's only rain. But George wasn't crying because it was raining. George was crying because he had lost Mr. Dinosaur. Peppa searched upstairs, downstairs, even in the toilet. She couldn't find Mr. Dinosaur anywhere. Then this had an idea. Peppa ran outside and found a very wet Mr. Dinosaur in Grandpa's very muddy vegetable garden. She ran inside and gave Mr. Dinosaur George. George was very happy. The rain has stopped. What can we do now? I have to go idea, Pepe. Daddy Pig's pointing outside. Hooray, cheered Pepe, seeing the muddiest puddle ever. Pepe had been so busy looking at 
Grandpa's vegetables and searching for Mr. Dinosaur had forgotten all about jumping puddles. Grunt, 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 scratch, scratch, scratch. Peppa loved jumping up and down the muddy puddles more than anything in the whole wide world. All Peppa's family loved jumping down muddy puddles to be more than anything in the whole wide world. Grunt, grunt, scratch. Hee 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 ha, oink oink. Hee 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 ha, grunt snored.